Okay, here, admission ticket, let me in. Why is there a trophy? Go-karts. Grand Prix Race 1, sure. Okay. Three laps. Why did I just gain time? I don't know what that, I don't know what the time that's being shown to me is. Or is that telling me how far behind I am, or how far people are behind me? When I'm hit passing certain checkpoints, that's probably it. I've played my fair share of racing games. <laughs> some of them I like, some of them I'm not a huge fan of. Love Diddy Kong Racing. I 100%ed that one. Uh, I liked Horizon Chase Turbo. That was a great game. Slipstream was fun. Uh, Project Cars pissed me off to no end. And the first F-Zero also drove me nuts. Helmet. I don't know how many Grand Prix there are here, but go, go for race two, I guess. Now I'm facing bullies. I'm going to assume that the uh, horse has changed a little bit this time around. Yep, that's a much tighter turn. Easy peasy. Never played an easier game in my life. I like how many different mini games they put in here though. It's kind of fun. I'm three seconds ahead. What are these scrubs doing? Clearly they're not racing me. God, 3.8 seconds? Too easy. I didn't unlock anything for that either. Alright, Grand Prix, Prix Race 3. Let's do it. Now I'm facing the preppies. See you later, nerds. Yeah, we're going straight this time. Oh, how did they all take that corner so so sh tightly? Where did they come from? <laughs> Wow, I've got some competition for once. Trying to shove me into the wall. I 
don't understand where they, how they get that that turn so tight. Heck off, my dude. Go, 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 gotta get first place. Go, 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 go. Woo! I was trash talking the last one, and then that one was a little, a little close. A little too close for comfort. Race four. Alright, I'm gonna keep doing them until I run out. Is there like one from each? I think I see a preppy and a two preppy. Oh, I oh don't know. The, are these the jocks? These actually might be the jocks. And there's five racers in here. God. <laughs> and I have to do four laps. Holy crap. Four seconds ahead of them, no way. Yeah, I believe 1.7, I don't believe four seconds. Like, my biggest complaint about, like, Project Cars when I played that was how easy it was to, like, spin out on a tight turn. I hated taking tight turns in that, in that game because I would just always spin out. And I know that's probably more realistic, but that's not fun for the player where I'm, I can't even turn. And so you have to, like, t sit there and practice how to actually do tight turns in that game. I dominated that one. First lap was a little rough. Smooth sailing from there, though. That's it. There's another one. I said I would keep going as long as I had a Grand Prix. Now there's six people, and it's another four lap race. Looks like we're facing the like greasers. Off of me, guy. Slowing me down.
I'm finding that not power sliding, but just straight up braking and then accelerating once I'm more in the direction I want is faster. And then of course you always want to try and take corners as tight as you can. And it doesn't seem like hitting the ed the like grass or the uh, um, the edge of the road really seems to slow you down much. So just I'm kind of treating that as part of the course too. And now I'm I'm just breaking away now. I'm almost four seconds ahead, and I still have a whole lap to get to to close to extend extend that distance. I can't speak. I have some water after this one. Then you always want to try and take as many straight lines as you can without making too many micro adjustments on your turns. This is all kind of like basic, like general race vice. You got it, it's fine. Easy. for the go-kart street race. Violating curfew? Uh-oh. I guess I lost, um... my chance to do a mission. But that was fun. I enjoyed that. Oh, this is the entrance. I need to go to the exit. So now we just need to get back. You're getting tired. Be in bed by 2 a.m. or you'll pass out on the spot. Well, that's not good, considering it's 1 a.m. It's not 1 a.m. Actually, it is, right? It is. Sorry. I'm... I'm so used to digital clocks that I have lost my ability to look at an analog clock and be able to tell exactly what time it is at a glance. And it sucks. <laughs> I have to like think about it for a minute. Alright. Sleep. I'm also not the biggest fan of this, uh, this sweater we got going on here. I look like a dweeb. We're gonna... Dweeb a little bit here. Look like a wife beater, not uniform. Cooler, but I feel like you just need the music keys. Aquaberry? No. We're just gonna go with the good old classic Bullworth vest. I, think it, ah, I gotta admit my choice. Except, there we go. All right, I have two missions and then I have one lawn mowing. I guess we'll go do a try and do a mission. Is there a bike I can steal. Movie tickets. Hey, Jimmy Hopkins. Do I know you? No, I'm Pinky, but I know all about you. Everybody's talking about you. Everybody says that you're mean and angry and you like fighting. Huh. Gary said you're so mad because you're sexually confused. Yeah, well, Gary talks a lot of crap. Oh, I know. I don't like him. He likes to torture people. So what? He's not gonna torture me. Well, I'm glad you're not sexually confused. Really? Yeah, I like 
Thank you, Jimmy Hopkins. Oh, yeah? What's the catch? I need you to do something for me. Ah. What a surprise. I'm last in line, and this movie means everything to me. I'm going to get terrible seats. Can you please get rid of all these people for me? Please, Jimmy. What's in it for me? I'm a princess, oh. and I need people to do things for me. So hurry up, because I want to be first. Oh, man. All right. That's the catch. She's crazy and spoiled. No violence, you say. Steal Gord's bike to lure him away. Easy. Nice shirt. Well, that worked out easy. Talk to Eunice. Give the chocolates. I already have chocolates. I was thinking of you when I got them. Here you go, Eunice. Enjoy that. Keep your face away from me. Okay, lead her to a secluded spot. I don't appreciate this music right now. Come on, Eunice, you can do it. gets rid of her. <laughs> We're not talking about that. I just wanna not play cool. Approach Trent and Kirby. That's great, Jimmy. Only oh, were they holding hands or something? Uh well I do have a few uses, you know. Oh really? Well, you know, nice girls like nice flowers. Anyway, here's some fun. It's the least I could do. And it's daddy's anyways. The show's about to start, but come see me sometime. We can work through these class issues we have. Oh, I'll work through your class issues all right, sweetie. Wow. Why'd I lose preppy respect? She was a preppy. That's that nonsense dealt with. All right, this was shining in the background the whole time. What is it? Card, okay. All right. Now we need... Take the bus. Got class. Very important. Don't don't skip school, kids. I am truant. Well, what are you gonna do about it, huh? Nice. Class, class, class. I don't know what class is in. Geography. Good day, everyone. I'm Mr. Matthews. Hi, Mr. Matthews. Geography teacher. I know you're all enthusiastic and ready to learn. Oh, I'm so ready. Otherwise, why would you be here? Match the flags to their corresponding province, state, or country? Uh oh. Oh no. Okay. Uh, this. Oh, this is Italy. Hmm. What do you mean, is, huh? But I'm this is. It's wrong. That's Italy. Oh, okay. Finland, ah oh crap. Um, I think Finland is this one. I think it's the one on the far east. Switzerland is down here. Okay, this is easy for me. I, I know the capitals and all this crap, so I should be able to do this pretty well. Ireland's over here. Germany is right there. Greece is down here. Spain's over here. France is up there. Poland is up here. No, oh, come I'm sorry, on. That is incorrect. It was there, I know that. Ukraine is over here. Portugal is next to Spain. Sweden is the one on the mid in the middle of the Nordic countries. Romania is down here. I have a friend from Romania. Denmark is right there. I had an exchange student from Denmark, and Norway is there. That's where my ancestors are from. This might be the best class for me. <laughs> Uh, until they do states and provinces. I got an Eiffel Tower hat. I can purchase clothes.
I wonder if these count as, uh... As being in uniform if I wear something. I don't know what qualifies as being in uniform and what's not. janitor's storeroom. Where are you going? Open. There you go. <laughs> Sorry, what was that noise? Oh, I've been down here. This is where Gary was leading me uh, before he ambushed me. Try to lob it into the stall, okay. I'm not trying to piss. I'm running out of time. Trying to, I don't remember how to aim. Oh, here we go. Okay. Time for the next class. Mark your glutes at a desk. Math. I'm pretty good at math. If I do I say so myself. Everyone's ready to learn something. This isn't English class, you know. Answer as many questions as you can before class ends. Okay. Three plus four is seven. Fifty is equal to five plus forty-five. Six times six is thirty-six. How many triangles? Two. What is the smallest? The bug. Twelve is twenty minus eight. What is the biggest? A planet. Which is the lowest? Two oh three. Eight plus three is eleven. A half is zero point five, which is the slowest. That would be the sloth. 120, three times 40. Seven minus five is two. The fastest would be the truck. 99 is 11 times nine. 12 plus nine. 35 is, nope, that's 36. Nope, seven times three, which is the fastest. Probably the, oh no, the rocket. Sorry, sorry about that. Forgive me. How many squares? One, two, three, four, five. A half of 34 is 17. 15 minus 6 is 9, which is the fastest. That would be the race car. 0 0.5 is 1 half. What is the tallest? The pyramid, which is the highest. 79. 7 plus 3 is 10. 24 is 12 times 2. Get a perfect score. Nailed it. Easy. Give me something harder next time. I rock. I got a genius hat. 